Hi guys, welcome to this session. In this session, we're going to talk about brand list features. So brand list is a feature which you get in the tool section shared library, which allows you to provide a list of brands for which you would like to show your ads or not show your ads. So you can use it for creating a restriction, which basically means that you can give a list of brands for which you would like your ads to appear only, or else you can use this list also as an exclusion wherein you would not like your ads to appear for such brand search queries. So let's have a look at this, guys, how we can make use of this feature. So once we are into our Google Ads account, we can go to the tools section where we can go to shared library where we have brand list option. So here we can create a new brand list option over here by first giving it a name. And then we can enter the names of the brand one by one in this particular manner. So once you provide these lists, then you can create this list specifically out here. And now you have the option to apply this as a restriction or as an exclusion. So applying it as a restriction, you can select the campaign on which you want to apply. And now this will be applied on this particular campaign, wherein your ads will be restricted to only these four brands, which we have shown you. So what's going to happen is the ads will only appear for search queries related to these brands. It will not appear to any other search queries apart from these brands. You also have an option for exclusion, which means that if you add it as an exclusion, then these your ads will be excluded from search queries for these brands, which is basically the opposite of restriction. I hope this makes sense. You understand now how we can make use of the brand list feature. Thank you so much, guys, for listening into this session. And I will see you in the next week.